Honestly, like this was, for me, coming here was all about like the experience. This was absolutely amazing. This week has been one of the most mentally and physically challenging weeks I've ever had in my life. I mean, from bow issues to deer that do literally the dodge, duck, dip, dive, and dodge to not seeing anything for like five out of the 10 hunts. I've learned so much this week. This has been such an amazing experience for me. You know, I come from a small town in South Carolina and I've never been able to hunt anywhere else. So this has been like surreal for me. Like this has been a dream come true to be able to experience something of this magnitude. It really has. So my whole week here out at the ranch has been awesome. I, I've really enjoyed everybody. You know, all the different personalities um, under stress and lack of sleep and grind. You know, we all seem to come together and we're, we're making it happen. And, and I'm thankful and I'm blessed to even have the opportunity to come out here. That's what's so awesome about the outdoors. We get to all come together and share the same passions. You know, we all have a passion for the outdoors and we get to share it. You know, and it's it's just heartwarming. I don't know how to explain it. I feel like, personally, I feel like God brought this all together. Welcome to For Love or Likes, the world's only Insta-famous hunting competition. This is the only show who takes hunters like me through the ultimate competition. Likes is brought to you by Hunter Safety System. Saving lives is what we do. I wanted to shoot while I was here a buck, a doe, and a hog. That was like my goal, you know? I've never shot a hog before, didn't know where to shoot a hog before, because all I heard is, you know, the skin is tough, you're not gonna kill them, that kind of thing. I almost, you know, a boar was like charging me the other night and I fell out of the deer stand. Well, that just ticked me off. So I'm gonna get me a hog, you know, for sweet revenge and to rack up some points. And this will be my first hog. I'm going out, you know, on a mission to get me a hog. I honestly hope that hog comes out so I can get some justice today. I just wanna drop him. So here goes nothing. We'll see how I do today. Hopefully that will get me something. Lo and behold, I hear all in the woods coming up and charging through, and I'm like, oh my God, this is it.
<laughs> but it was revenge. It was revenge from the boar the night before. So I went out to murder. <laughs> The last hunt of the evening has come. So this hunt is super important. We were so excited for this spot and everyone's kind of talked about like bucks being in this area. So let's just, you know what? Let's give it one more go. Oh my goodness, it is Halloween. It's a full moon. It was our last hunt. Like what more could this week actually handle? Today is the last day that we have to make it happen. And I'm gonna make it happen. Which, positive vibes, I'm gonna make it happen. I'm gonna win this whole show, but my strategy is to stack up does until my shooter buck or one of my bucks decides to step in. I'm just out here slinging arrows like Pocahontas. <laughs> no big deal. Oh, we got a doe over here. I, th I think I'm gonna do it. I smoke her It's obvious to me Nicole is the dark horse of this race. She's been stacking up those, killing hogs, winning challenges, and she's got a giant buck. If she gets double vision down, she can clearly win this thing, and she is gun ho gunning for the For Lover Likes victory. But then 